In the days of film screen radiography, images were comprised of microscopic silver dots captured in a gelatin matrix. In digital radiography, the image is made up of small dots projected on a computer screen with various shades of gray. The shades of gray represent radiation dose measurements captured by the imaging plate. Here is a digital radiograph of me taken before my hair turned gray. Though it may not be apparent, this image and everything seen on the screen is comprised of small colored dots. If we magnify the right eye area of the picture, notice how the image becomes blocky and the appearance less sharp. These blocks are called pixels. All computer images and characters, including your radiographs, are made of these small dots, most so small that they are not visible without magnification. The term pixel is derived from the first two letters of the word picture and the word element. Take the PI from picture and the EL from the word element and add an X to tie the word fragments together. Most computer screens can display different resolutions. The screen I'm currently using prefers a 1,280 pixels across by 1,024 pixels down for a total of 1,310,720 total pixels on the screen. Typically, commercial computer screens display 1 million pixels, which is the screen density of displays included with most of your, Im your imaging systems. This is not the pixel density necessary for diagnostic purposes. Radiologist diagnostic displays range from 3 to 8 million pixels per screen. In addition to the pixel count, my computer devotes 32 one-bit memory locations to each pixel to display different colors. This means on my computer, each pixel on my screen can display more than 4 billion different colors. While the display screen is made up of pixels, the radiographic imaging plate is also made of pixels as well. A common CR plate is scanned by laser dots defining the pixel size. The size of the dot can be controlled by software. A 14 by 17 plate is scanned at a rate of about six pixels per millimeter for a total of 6,556,320 pixels on a 14 by 17 image. On the other hand, a Fuji DR plate is made up of 6,624,896 small radiation detectors. For a DR plate, the size of the pixel is determined by the manufacturer during fabrication. Each detector is capable of recording 16 bits per pixel or 65,536 different radiation levels. These radiation levels range from one one hundredth of a millisievert to some maximum value. What you as a radiographer need to understand is the impact pixel count has on the final image. As pixel count increases, the spatial resolution of the image will increase. Imaging plates tend to vary from 3 pixels per millimeter to about 20 pixels per millimeter. The higher number more commonly used in mammographic imaging. Most radiographic imaging plates seem to average about 6 to 10 pixels per millimeter. Additionally, for DR technology, the more pixels make up, the more expensive imaging plates. Detector elements are printed on the plate substrate and the production costs escalate as the elements become smaller. Whereas a CR plate, the pixel size is controlled by refocusing or collimating the laser beam to a smaller area of the plate surface. The ultimate input impact of more pixels means that more data for the computer to process, 
and this leads to the need for larger and larger storage devices and more computer memory requirements. More data also impacts the speed data can be displayed and longer transmission times when we want to move the data from one location to another. Most of these speed and capacity problems become less severe each year because computers become more powerful and hard disks larger. In the past, radiographic resolution was measured using a resolution grid and specified in line pairs per millimeter. The more line pairs per millimeter visible on a radiograph, the higher the detail or spatial resolution. One can use pixels per millimeter to estimate the line pairs per millimeter for a given plate. An object or a line needs to span about two pixels or more to be reliably recorded by a digital imaging system. So, if one takes the pixels per millimeter specification, divides that number by two, the answer will be what one would expect to resolve in line pairs per millimeter. If a plate specifies a resolution to be six pixels per millimeter, we would find the expected resolution would be about three line pairs per millimeter. Here is an example of a resolution grid radiograph and at six lines per millimeter, we would expect to see in the range of 2.8 to 3.1 line pairs per millimeter. Below is an example of the math behind computer file size. File size is roughly a product of the number of pixels an image times the number of bits per pixel, which is the number of radiation levels a plate can record minus any compression applied to that image. The formula above represents the number of pixels times the number of bits per pixel minus any file compression. The whole product is then divided by 8 because file size is normally specified in bytes. For an AGFA CR24 plate, this works out to about 10 megabytes per file, assuming no compression. I'm 11 megabytes per file for the Fuji DR plate. The larger file size of the DR plate is attributable to the slightly higher pixel count and the more bits per pixel in the Fuji plate. To add some scale to this discussion, below are three boxes. The first square is a millimeter in size, the next a square centimeter, and the last a square inch. This first square would contain about 36 pixels. The second square is one centimeter by one centimeter in size. If we do the math, it is 100 times larger than the previous square and therefore contains 3,600 pixels. The third square is one inch and contains 23,226 pixels. To add some scale regarding what happens when pixel count increases, at the pixel density of 10 pixels per millimeter, the 1 millimeter box contains 100 pixels, the centimeter box about 10,000 pixels, and the square inch box about 64,516 pixels. Thank you for your attention. This will end my presentation.